U.S. President Donald Trump's term in the Oval Office hit the six-month mark on Thursday, promising a radical break from his predecessor's policies on everything from diplomacy to immigration and health care. His young presidency has witnessed some progress and a whole lot of controversy. Oh Jong-hee has the details. Six months have passed since the U.S. President Donald Trump started his term in the White House, and on Thursday, the Oval Office released an array of the Trump administration's achievements, bringing accountability back to the government, creating jobs, getting rid of regulations, and promoting free and fair trade. The White House emphasized that it's been striving to always put, quote, America first. I want to make a pledge to each and every one of you. No longer are we going to allow other countries to break the rules, steal our jobs, and drain our wealth. And it has been drained. Since President Trump's inauguration, the U.S. has withdrawn from the Trans-Pacific Partnership, and now it's on the move to renegotiate the North American Free Trade Agreement, or NAFTA. The White House mentioned these as a couple of their achievements and announced that President Trump began the process of renegotiating the Korea-U.S. Free Trade Agreement last week. It's all to protect American manufacturing and rebalance Washington's trade relationship with other countries to reduce its deficit. But his approval rating is sinking to the lowest rating of any U.S. president at the six-month mark of their first term. The number sits at just 36 percent, according to a recent poll by The Washington Post and ABC News. Trump care has not been successful. You know, Russia scandal cases, all that kind of things are making him kind of in a you know risky place domestically. So I think he's now trying to you know recover by you know making some achievements in foreign policy terms. Plenty of challenges lie ahead for President Trump, especially regarding North Korea's continued advancements in its nuclear and missile programs. Despite Trump's push to apply maximum pressure on the regime and convince China to pacify Pyongyang, his efforts have made little headway thus far. Oh Jong-hee, Arirang News.